So I'm gonna alternate here between looks that are outdoor and ones that are just for inside. First look, I'm starting off with an ice blue button up paired with some light wash jeans. And then I'm going to layer in a tan crew neck sweater, which is by Everlane. I'm going with these hiking boots here. They're by Danner, really classic with red laces. For the coat, I'm doing just a classic pea coat and then I'm throwing on these braided leather gloves by Hilt Willard. Uh, I've been really into 1970s Robert Redford style recently, and this look is 100% influenced by his style in Three Days of the Condor, from the pea coat to the layered sweater, all the way down to the hiking boots, but I think his were a little darker uh, and didn't have red laces, but whatever. So this is just a super easy look to throw together. All basics, they're comfortable and great for winter. This next look is my favorite Canadian tuxedo, polo Ralph Lauren Western shirt and double RL jeans. I'm gonna pair this with my black watch plaid Belgian shoes, which I love wearing around the house. And then throwing on this tan zip up cashmere cardigan by Gobi Cashmere. Uh, I find even if I'm just sitting around and working at home, I do like to put uh, just a little effort into what I'm wearing. I feel like it just puts me in a different mindset than if I was just sitting around in like sweatpants and a hoodie. Nothing wrong with that, by the way. Uh, but even just something this simple and of course a little elevated via the cashmere motivates me to get things done. I'm starting off again with some faded jeans and a great super comfortable and warm cream colored cable knit sweater and I'm going to pair this with some white leather sneakers to keep it kind of casual and sporty. Over that, I'm going to layer on a barber quilted vest and then some shearling gloves and finishing it off with a tan wool knit cap by Drake's. I really like how sporty this look is and there's some great contrasts with both the blues and the browns. The sweater is actually by Sunspell and it's so thick and warm, I find it's a great sweater to pair with just a quilted vest like this. The gloves, I absolutely love. It's another pair by Hilt Willard. Not only are they warm, but I think they add a really nice bit of understated color and contrast with the rest of this very simple look. Here I've got black jeans and a burgundy striped cashmere turtleneck by Gobi. And since this is an at-home look, I'm going to slip on my black suede Belgian shoes. Such great shoes for wearing around the house. And then to add in a layer, because it is a little chilly down in the studio, I'm throwing on this wool overshirt or shacket, which I've had forever and is actually by H&M made with cloth by Abraham Moon. I love wearing jackets and sport coats, but you know, at home it might feel like a little much, so a shacket like this is a great alternative. I like how the stripe of the sweater pulls in the color of the shacket. It's not an exact match, but that's almost better. And fun fact, as I record this voiceover, this is the outfit I am wearing today as well. Featuring the shacket again, this time with some dark denim. And since I'm going to be walking the dog and it's been a little muddy, I'm going with these L.L. Bean gum shoes. Then I'm going to use a scarf here. It's by Barber in their classic plaid. Throwing on my Barber jacket. This is the Ashby model, if you're wondering. Then the same Drake's hat you've already seen and the Shearling Hilt Willard gloves. Something I've been doing a lot recently that you see here is when I layer in a jacket like this, I like to pop the collar along with the jacket collar because I like how it sticks out, creates a layering effect, uh, and is a way to give even a super casual look like this a little bit of a stylish twist. Here I've got light wash jeans and a brown brush cotton shirt, which I'm gonna pair again with the black watch plaid Belgian shoes. Uh, wanna add another layer for some warmth here, so I'm throwing on a thin merino wool quarter zip sweater, which is by Sunspell. Pretty simple and no nonsense look here. Again, I feel like actually taking the time to do even just simple layering like this and putting on an actual button up shirt can do a lot for staying positive and being productive. And I mean, it doesn't take a lot. This is just so simple, but it's something I found that really works for me. Going with black jeans once again, this time with a buffalo plaid shirt by Uniqlo. And also again, the black suede Belgian shoes. For my extra layer here, I'm throwing on this great chunky shawl collar cardigan, which is by Tommy Hilfiger. Another piece I've had for quite a long time. 
I will do my best to find something similar to link to in the description. If you're looking for some more winter outfit inspiration, I've put together a playlist for you that has some more casual outfit ideas, uh, some winter trends that I think are actually worth following, some business casual outfit ideas, and a complete winter capsule wardrobe. So go ahead and click right over there for some more great winter inspiration.